Hello, this is Matthew with PaymentInc.com. Um, I'll be getting a lot of questions from people who want to learn how to, you know, add products to Virgin Mart. So I am doing a basic tutorial for cover three things. The first, how do you create a, a product category? Second, how do you add a product? And the third, how do you connect a menu with that particular product or category you created? So uh, I'm in uh, Virgin Mart control panel right now. So you go to product categories. and you click on new the category name I'm just going to put in demo Numa. publish yes the alias if you don't know what the alias is just leave it blank you know the system is automatically going to use the category name as the alias that's just for search engine purposes uh, for the description I'm just going to put in demo Joomla ordering and all this stuff you don't have to worry much about this uh, part right here for now uh, and then if you want to add a page title uh, demo Joomla submitted description for search engines I'm just going to put that in there uh, for keywords use that now for me to robots you want to use index slash follow this just let the search engines know that they can follow this particular uh, product or page and then for the author you want to put in your website name or your name and then you want to go to images uh, if you don't really have an image to put in there let's just leave this blank now so you get a visual of what it is going to look like so click on save and close okay then the next thing you want to do is you want to go to products Hit new. Okay, for product SKU, just put in one, two, three, four, whatever number you want it to be. If you're creating a, a if you have a certain pattern or order that you want to, you know, have the SKU as, you can do that. Uh, for the product name, demo Joomla. For the product alias, once again, uh, if you don't know what it is, Joomla is going to automatically uh, propagate that for you. Uh, for the price, just put in whatever the amount is. The currency, U.S. dollars. Now there is a section on the on um, uh, virtual mode where you can automatically set your currency. But for the purpose of this demo, I just want to show you how to add product, create categories, and link it up with the menu. So your price is set. Uh, there's the tax stuff. You don't have to worry about that for now. And then for the category. What you want to do is just type in the category name and Joomla is automatically going to pull it up. So that's the category, the demo Joomla we created. Product description, just put in a short description and then you want to put an extensive description. And then product status, how many do you have in stock? If you have more than one, two, if it's unlimited, just leave it at zero. Uh, and then all this stuff is just kind of basic stuff that you can update uh, for the image how long is it going to be before they actually get their stuff within two to three days or three to five days so we'll just put that there product dimension all this stuff if you have the dimensions form and you can kind of mess with this stuff here uh, product image this is where you can upload an image So for now, I'm not going to upload the image just yet. Custom fills, you can add additional custom fills um, on this part. So just go ahead and hit save and close. Okay, so now you go to menus, you go to top. Now you have to, wherever your menus are, maybe your menus are not designed like the ones here. It's probably named something else, but um, you go to that menu and you click on the menu and you click on menu item type scroll down to virtual mark category layout or you can list categories layout so for now I'm just going to have the category layout and the, the name demo products 
And for the alias, once again, I'm not going to put anything there. Delete it. Okay, I'm just going to use Demo Joomla. On the top level. And then for. Okay, everything's set to go. Alright, so you click on save. Okay, now if you go on the home page and refresh, you see the menu will create it once you click on it. There you have it. You have some of the products that were listed there. And here's the demo Joomla. We didn't put an upload an image to it, which I'm going to show you how to do. But I just wanted you to see how it's going to look on the front end. So once you create categories, it's just a virtual mark. It's going to line it up for you like this, or you can change the format. So you click on that particular category. And here's the demo Joomla stuff that we created. And it has the sale price on there, price without tax, and product detail. So this is the description that we added in the back. Sales price, and you know someone can add to cart. Remember the back end, the back end. For the delivery time, two to three days, they can ask a question about this particular product. Um, so that's how you add it now. For the images, if you want to add an image to it, it's really simple. You go to Virtual Mart and you, you go to Products. You select the product that you want to add, upload the image to. Product images, upload. You click on browse to select the product from your computer, and I'm just going to pick this one. Okay, once I pick that, save and close. Okay, come back on here, right click, reload, and there you have it. Now if you notice the product, the image is, is a little bit too big, but I just wanted to show you that you can upload the product image there. Let's just go ahead and just change that. Hmm, I wonder who's this handsome fella. Okay, alright, so remove. Browse again from your computer. I'll pick something that's a little bit smaller. Right, that should do it. Okay. Save. And as you can see, it's you know once you get the hang of it, then you can be able to. Um, okay, that ain't go dark. You can be able to make whatever necessary changes that you make. You can upload. Uh, images to the category, images to the product. Okay, so now if I come here and I click refresh, you notice it's so much more smaller. So that's just some of the basic ways that you can, you know, create a product category, you know, add a product and then link it up to the menu. So there's a lot more details in terms of how Virtual Mart works and some other things that um, I'll create those for you in another tutorial. But please, if you have any questions or anything, feel free to just let me know or just visit our website at caymaninc.com. And once again, this is Matthew and I will see you later.